Hey y'all, Mr. Tim's here. So uh, another uh, project here with my garage door. The one of my uh, remotes had uh, gone bad. I decided to get a new one. This is a Chamberlain, a Universal Remote, and I got it from the um, we got it from Lowe's. Picked it up last night. It was around thirty nine, thirty four, or thirty nine dollars. Forgive me, I can't can't remember. But uh, I'm just going to go through the um, the kind of setup process here. Um, so I'll get it out of the package and we'll show you what I got here. Um, it comes with this, this piece itself, a clip, and the instructions. And uh, I tested it here. You can see the blue light flashing there. It already um, has the batteries in it ready to go. So um, I'm up here on the ladder and... Uh, I'm back over here and, and my particular box has a learn button there. You can see it flashing there. Um, and so that's how I'm going to program mine. It's in the instructions, it gives you two different ways where you have to set the pin code and all that. But we're going to go through this learn button, which I think is the uh, one of the uh, most common ways, especially for your Chamberlains. All right. Uh, so I got the instructions out here, and then here it is talking about the learn button, and the different option is the uh, what they call the dip switch or the DIP switch. Let's see if I can get that in focus. Uh, that's what we we do not have. I have the learn button, which is this option up here, and you can see here. Um, now one on, one part on the instructions tells you that depending on what color this learn button is, is how many times you have to press um, the button. And so, look here on the chart, and I have a, a, a Chamberlain. It says red or orange. You can see right there. Uh, it says number of times to press the button. I'm going to have to press it twice before um, I get this to memorize itself. So, there it is. Uh, it's over there flashing. It is uh, orange, orange, red. So, that's what I'm going to do here. So, we're going to go through the, the steps here. Okay, so now per the instructions here, uh, I'm gonna pull this cover off and I'm just gonna set that down here. That's little Mr. Tim's over there, he's playing in the garage. So inside this button here, I have to press this little button down in here until the light comes on. The light's on. Now we're gonna go over here, we're gonna press that learn button here. I'm gonna press and hold that. And now it wants me to hit this twice until it stops blinking. Got to hold that till it stops blinking. Doing a lot of blinking. All right, so the garage door made a flash. Let's turn this off. And now let's try it. Stop it. It works. All right. So, if you missed that last bit of what I did, the lights were still on here. I came in and I pushed this again to kind of close the program mode. Um, and then it's activated, okay? So I can put my cover back on here and now she's working fine. All right, so that's that's all there is to it. If you got any questions or comments or kind of frustrated with the sequence, can't get it, um, give me a shout. I'm gonna go ahead and put some uh, lubricant on these uh, chains while I'm up here. And Mr. Tim's gonna play with his robot. So uh, I appreciate y'all. Send me some comments if you have it or questions. Thanks. Bye.